What's up YouTube? What's up? How are you all doing? Hope all is well. I'm your lady, Ambitious Jackie, and I'm just gonna talk to you about a, a few minutes while doing some cooking like guys I we're going to do my usual um Sunday cooking we know my regular our regular rice and peas with fish and my steamed vegetable that's what I wanted to cook today guys one we get up and um my husband went to scale fish yeah you know those things and then after my stomach just start giving me feelings like nauseous feelings everything that i eat guys if i drink cold water nauseous feelings everything i eat or drink nauseous feelings guys i am not feeling well so the fish that we prepared we were um looking after preparing to um we were sorting out for dinner i'm just completely turned off from what i prepare or what i were going to prepare for dinner guys my stomach give me feelings for things the stomach tell me guys what it want to eat and drink guys i will think like i want fish today the stomach say no no fish today so you know what the stomach give me feelings for guys some chicken back soup honestly so that is what i'm gonna prepare i talked to my husband and i said to him you know that my stomach not giving me the feelings for that um fish dinner tonight big and i start telling him about the nauseousness that i'm going through from early this morning there's no pain but just nauseous in my stomach guys as if somebody have young pregnancy this is something I trouble that troubles me all the time, but this one is really severe. So I think enough um if it continues for the rest of the day, tomorrow I'm going to see my doctor. Because guys, I do everything that they said to do. I even do what they don't tell me because I'm looking after myself. Guys, there is not I don't go overboard. The doctor's advice i stick to the doctor's advice guys but no the bitterness in my mouth with the feelings guys it's no joke so i'm here sitting down and i will take my time just to prepare this type of soup i don't want chicken foot in it because i have chicken foot but i'm not a lover of chicken foot and um so I'm going to I, um, use the chicken, chicken back, the one that, not the local, the ordinary one that we normally use, that's the, the, the more meaty one, because they know the long time one, guys, is uh, too much fat. So guys, see I did already, as you can see, I already wash and clean them, scrape the fat off and everything, guys, and I cut the pumpkin, and all this now is washed and clean, and... Uh, with vinegar and um, things ready to cook and I put the water on to boil because I put before I put meat when I'm doing soup I always boil my water or make the water well hot because to prevent this fraud problem business so in this soup today guys today Sunday hmm, I am going to put this is my little bits and pieces that I have to put in um potato irish potato my daughter said don't say irish mom just say potato but we used to be irish but saying irish potato and the chocho and um carrot and as always my garlic a bit of garlic when i put the meat and the pumpkin to boil i'm gonna put a bit of garlic and put a piece of but this slice a small piece of yellow yam with I might put two dumplings because guys I don't know what's happening inside my stomach because what happened guys the things that I love most I am turned off completely 
since I came back from hospital, guys, the things that I love, I am turned off completely from everything that I love. So, this morning I'm thinking, wonder if I'm turning off from rice and peas. Guys, if a Sunday come and I don't cook rice and peas, it's as if I'm not cooking. And today, I am not into the rice and peas. The stomach said, no, no rice and peas and whatever today. Chicken back soup, guys. So, guys... We'll now further do, do delay. I'm just going to prepare it. And I hope when I eat, eat it, then it's what it wants and it doesn't give me problem later. Because this morning, I only had um, a slice of bread and a cup of mint tea. That's all I felt for because the stomach, as I say again, it's just, just that what, it's, what it wants. So... The water for the the pot the um to put the meat and the pumpkin to boil. Oh, it's now boiling, guys. So I'm gonna put my pumpkin and my meat to boil. Oh Jesus! So I'm gonna put them in, guys. Putting them in to boil. Guys, I am not having it easy at all. No, not easy. Not easy at all, guys. But I'm gonna make it. With God by my side, guys, I am gonna make it. Trust me. I won't give up. I will not give up. So guys, it's there and I'm gonna, I feel so I even have to be sitting down, guys. I'm gonna put the garlic in now, guys. So, I will get back to you later. Okay, guys? So, okay, guys, I peeled my yam and I made two dumplings, but this is a bit too much, so... I'm going to put a few of them into my soup and then put the rest into another pot. Boil them, cool them and put in the fridge. I won't waste them. Waste things, guys. As I said before, I don't waste things. Okay. Don't waste things at all. So my yam is clean and ready to go in my pot. So guys, am I, I'm going to put my seasoning in my, my skill and my thyme in my pot, put the thyme and I'm going to beat my scallion. See guys, scallion is in. Guys, it looks looking delicious as well, and ready as well. So I'm gonna put this scallion, let this scallion and the thyme boil in it some more. Normally, guys, I would put a scotch barnet pepper, but no, nothing like that. No pepper at all, guys. No pepper. Pepper is a no no for me. guys you know what all these are but guys I am gonna tell you on another video the purpose of this I'm gonna make another video and tell you what I do with all these things I'm gonna tell you okay guys so the seasoning and everything is boiling okay I'm gonna put my cup soup in it now, guys, and leave to simmer down. Simmer, simmer, simmer down. So, all right, guys, um, my Sunday soup is ready. As you can see, let me bring this nearer to you that you can see my Sunday soup. See, guys, it's ready. Okay. 
ready 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 hope this stomach likes it I do what i can so hope this stomach likes it guys so okay guys it's finished this is the end product this is for is and this is for her guys it is delicious guys i'm telling you it to me just my camera guys to me it um the taste is um guys sorry about that to me guys the taste it's i don't know i'm just looking after it because there is no butter added, nothing even with the um the the meat itself, the chicken back self. Guys, I have us to remove the fat from it as much as I can before I um before I, I washed it. I remove all fats and then when it start boiling, I had was to skim again, remove from the top the grease again to get rid of all grease so now guys you can see there is no grease nothing is good it's good guys very 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 well good very very good guys As you can see guys it's, it's all right yes guys it's very good so guys this is all I have to for today. Today is Sunday, and this is all I have to give you on my little health issue. And guys, before I go, I forget that I didn't ask you to like my videos, thumbs up, subscribe, share, turn the notification bell on that when I drop a video you'll be notified I don't, i'm not even sure because of this stress the distress i'm having in my stomach guys i didn't even remember i don't remember if i did say that in the first part of the video but if i didn't i'm asking you to forgive me because you know the brain will slip up and the stomach as i said before it's not in the right mind it's it's taking over my mind but by god's will i will be better so guys as always i'm asking you to always continue to support me, support my video, and um, keep me in your prayers, guys. Because, guys, it's not easy for me. One day I'm upright and chubby, the next day I'm down, and I'm like this feeling helpless all morning. A few minutes ago, now I feel the side. I know whatever happening inside here is caused from the thing. Now, a few minutes ago, this side, the thing, it start paining me, so I'm gonna try and consume a bit of my soul. Then afterward, I take a painkiller, guys, because I am trying to keep myself out of hospital. I'm trying very, very hard. So guys, I'm gonna love you and leave you. Continue to support me, guys. Pray for me while I do the same for myself. Guys, you can't be good, be careful. Enjoy the rest of your day. God bless you. Thanks for watching.